हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू सौरव सर्स क्लासेस टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू गिव यू सम इन्फॉर्मेशन ऑन मैथमेटिकल ओलम्पियाड नाउ द स्टेज वन इज द आर एम ओ that is the regional mathematical olympiad now this is generally held between september and the first sunday of december each year a regional coordinator makes sure that at least one center is provided in every district of the region it is a 3 hour written test which contains about 6 to 7 problems all high school high school students up to class 12 are eligible to appear for rmo to appear for rmo interested students should get in touch with the rmo coordinator of the region well in advance for enrollment and payment of a nominal fee then the next stage that is stage 2 is the indian national mathematical olympiad that is in mo this is held on the first sunday of february every year at different centers and different students the students who are selected on the basis of rmo from various regions so students selected an rmo from various regions are eligible to appear for nmo it is a 4 hour written test only the top 30 to 35 performers in nmo receive a merit certificate the next the stage 3 is the international mathematical olympiad training camp that is imotc this is a training level for the inmo certificate awardees
so this is a training level for the inmo certificate awardees they are invited for a month long training camp so month long training camp that is for the junior batch conducted in may june each year also in addition inmo awardees of previous year who have satisfactorily completed the postal tuition throughout the year are again invited for a second round of training they are called the senior batch now the stage 4 which is the final stage is the international mathematical olympiad that is imo now a leader and deputy leader are chosen by the nbhm from among mathematics teachers researchers involved in the mathematics olympiad activity so the team selected at the end of the camp the leader and the deputy leader represent india at the international mathematical olympiad that is normally held in july so this is held in july in a different member country of imo each year the imo consists of two written tests held on two days with a gap of at least one day both the tests are four and a half hours the eligibility criteria for the students is only students of class 9 10 11 and 12 can participate in rmo however regional coordinators have the discretionary power to allow 
any class 8 student with exceptional mathematical talent talent to sit for the RMO the syllabus for the exam or for the RMO or all the stages is class 9th to 12th standard mathematics the typical areas of problems are number theory algebra geometry and combinatorics the syllabus does not include statistics and calculus so the syllabus does not include statistics and calculus though the syllabus is roughly spread over class 9 to class 12 levels Still, the problems under each topic are of an exceptionally high level in difficulty and sophistication as compared to the textbook problems. And also, the difficulty level increases from RMO to NMO to IMO. So say if this is RMO, this is NMO and this is IMO. The difficulty level keeps on increasing. Thank you for watching our video, and you can call WhatsApp or message us at nine eight three six seven nine three zero seven six for further details and also visit our website that is www dot dot com thank you once again